Hey guys, what's up? So this week is story week on YTL, so I thought, why don't I just tell a story about how YTL got started? So here you go. <laughs> So it all starts with Jace and I because we are the ones who originally came up with the idea for the channel and we met in a very interesting way. Originally I had a pretty big following on Twitter, I had over 22,000 followers and Jace found me through Twitter and figured he couldn't contact me because he didn't think I would get his tweets. So he was on YouNow one day and he told everyone to go spam me and tell me that I should go tweet back to him. So I got all these tweets and I was looking through them and I'm like, oh, who's Jace Paragord? So all these people start tweeting, oh my god, go into his you now, go into his you now, blah, 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 blah. So I was like, okay, I guess I'm going to go into his you now. But anyway, we got talking and we started texting each other and a few weeks before the last day of school, I tweeted out, what if I did a collab channel? Because I had been looking at collab channels and I thought they were really cool and why not? So Jace texted me later that day and told me that he was very much interested and he really liked the idea, so we started the whole thing. Funny little tip here, the original name for YTL was For The Fangirls because I started the channel already and I thought it was really funny. But nobody else liked the name because they thought it shaved down the whole idea of who would be watching us, so that didn't go through. But anyway, we started with Chase Goharing, Connor Richard, me, and Jace. And Connor and Chase both ended up dropping out. Both of them because they didn't think that they had enough time, so we went on a search. So it was Jace and I on the whole adventure to find people. I had originally started by writing on forums and stuff like that, and a lot of the people that came forward weren't exactly who we wanted for the job. So I started searching on the YouTube 1,000 subscriber videos, hopefully finding people that had over 1,000 subscribers that made videos for it, and nobody came up. But I ended up finding a channel who was connected to a channel who was connected to a channel who was connected to a collab channel. A collab channel that crashed. Now this collab channel contained Taylor, and I thought, Looking through all these guys, Taylor would be the best. I thought he was funny, he had great content, and he was perfect in front of the camera. So I found his Twitter and his email, both of which I messaged him on, and he said he was interested, so we had our Wednesday. So, looking for the next guy was probably the hardest thing ever. I went on forums, I made a video for it, and nothing came forward until one night at around 11.30, it was right before my finals had even started, and I got an email from Matthew Devrez, and he told me that he was interested, and he was a little old for the job, but he could do it. So I was like, oh god, this guy is good, he makes good videos, he's funny, and he he's just gonna do good. So I added him, and we had four guys. So after that, we continued going, looking for people, and found nobody, until three days before the collab channel even started. It had over 100 subscribers already, and Peyton tweeted me and said, hey, how do I get in? We were pretty desperate for people, and Peyton was pretty good, and he made some awesome videos, so we we're like, Peyton, let's go. We need you now. So we started making videos and we actually really, really enjoyed it and I love this channel so much. But we now have six guys on the channel, so where did the six guy come from? Basically, I was looking through the inbox one day of comments and stuff like that and I found a message from a guy named Aaron Carpenter. So I messaged him and we started talking a little bit more. I ended up getting Aaron's number and we started texting all the time and I became really good friends with him and I thought, why don't we just add him to the channel? So we started talking to people about six members and stuff like that, and some people were with it, some people were against it, so we thought, why don't we hold a tryout and see who shows up and see how the audience likes each of them. So there was actually a lot of tryouts, and we went through and we chose around five of them and kind of put them out to the people, and they all ended up liking Aaron. So we ended up getting Aaron added to the channel, and that's how it is now. And I honestly couldn't ask for anything better or anyone better on this channel because they are some of the coolest guys. I talk to them every single day, and we've become such good friends. I honestly wouldn't want anyone more or anyone less. They are awesome. So thank you for watching how YTL started, and the only thing I can say to you guys is thank you so much for 3,000 plus subscribers in two months of making videos. That's insane, and I, I love you guys. You guys are awesome. So thank you for watching. Yeah, all right, yeah, main channel video below. Leave a like if you love YTL. And uh, remember guys, it's all about that YouTube life. Peace out. Oh God. <laughs>